just unveiling a proposed list of Chinese imports that could be subject to additional tariffs. Washington accusing China of unfair trade practices. CGTN's Nathan King is at the White House with details. Nathan. Yeah, Mike, uh, we expected it, but uh, uh, it's a big hit, uh, whatever. Um, basically, it's going to be uh, 1,300 products uh, that are on this list. Uh, not tariffs right away, I'll get to that in a second, but it's about $50 billion worth of Chinese imports and about 25% is the proposed tariffs. Even my math can cope with that. $12.5 billion. That's very uh, big indeed. And the list is long. I mean, there's uh, 1,300 products on it. And we've seen everything from syringes to helicopters uh, to fire extinguishers and even golf carts as well. Um, so uh, what's going to happen now is basically this uh, list is going to be open for consultation for U.S. businesses up until May 22nd. So these tariffs won't be imposed until at least we think the end of May, beginning of June. At the same time, uh, the uh, uh, Americans have said they're, they're willing to start consultations at the World Trade Organization over Chinese practices and work out some sort of mechanism to talk about. But as we know, at the WTO, these things take weeks, uh, months and years as well. And as we also know, there are other uh, uh, proposals coming down from the U.S. about restricting Chinese investment as well. So um, let's see where we are. But this list uh, was exactly what the U.S. said it would do. Uh, and it's being published, and we've got about a month or, or, or two to work out whether there's going to be any settlement over this. Yeah, let's, let's talk about that. There is some time for talks. Uh, any room, do you think, there for a settlement? Well, we do know there's uh, uh, communications between the Treasury Secretary here in Washington, uh, Steve Mnuchin, and his counterpart, Liu He, uh, in Beijing. Uh, but this list got released after we know those talks have happened. So does that suggest there's any progress? Not really. So uh, we'll have to wait and see if something like that happens. Also, the language that the U.S. is, is using uh, on announcing these proposed tariffs is, ve is very strong indeed. Uh, basically, uh, targeting China, made in China 2025 blueprint for China, trying to uh, uh, create global champions in the in the, in the industries of tomorrow and basically accusing them uh, of trying to get U.S. technology to do this by fair or foul means. Uh, this is not just about reducing the trade deficit. This is not just some sort of trade spat. This is the Trump administration essentially saying we're in an economic war right now with the Chinese for the future. 